Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Grand Cross video, and uh, yeah, today we're going to be doing some PvP because we finally got 200k CC, uh, flat CC pretty much, no extra, uh, like what, uh, bonuses from eating food or anything like that. Um, now granted, may, may not be the first person to do it of course, right? I know I'm probably a bit late to it, but um, considering my team... Uh, well, I've given, what, two UR pieces away, like uh, sets, full sets to, uh, Derriere and also, uh, Deldry. Obviously, Deldry was a video because I did hit 100 likes on it. Uh, but yeah, that team, or them two people, obviously aren't a part of this team. So, if I gave someone, like, UR, or well, give UR gear the king, we would have been chilling. We would have been probably, like, what, 210 maybe? Uh, especially if I did buy all the cosmetics for even Eskinor and King. Um, I should buy Eskinor's equipment, but, or cosmetics, but I just haven't. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, we just got there. And uh, the annoying thing is, I would rather use Blue King, but if I put Blue King on, uh, he does have less CC than Red King, which um, I don't know why, it just it just is. Uh, if I use Blue King, I have 1.98, like I'm missing 200 CC, like almost 300. So that's not enough for the video, uh, which is annoying because I don't really want to use this team. I'd rather have Eskinor here and Blue King here, which may be a little bit better. Uh, so if we do run into Gopher and we get attack disabled, we're kind of screwed. Uh, but yeah, this is the current team just just to get the 200k CC mark at least if, when we do play in PvP right now um, We should be okay at least because we're starting first so we could pro probably rush all especially bring CC food because if you don't know, I was going to make a video with this team anyway. Um, I think it's called proliferate. I'm not really sure. It's this skill here. So this skill When you get to tier 1 and tier, well, tier 2 and tier 3, it fills up ultimate gauge and that Eren does that, so he's gonna rush ult. We have uh, Lost Fane, who uh, does that as well. We have this one here, so I think it's called Proliferate. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's what it is. Um, and we have Eskinor as well, that's doing the exact same thing. So we essentially have a 50 50 chance to get an ult first turn because all we have to do is get one skill, one card from either characters, and then uh, we can drag. Use the skill and boom, we got an ultimate, especially bring ultimate food. And uh, yeah, so at least if we start first, we should be chilling. Um, my gear for all of them is by far my best gear. Like I've made mobile videos now uh, on like Aero, for example, 44k CC. Um, I lost things a bit nasty. Not don't even hold him back because the fact he's 2 6. Otherwise, he'd probably have like what 4. 4.7 right now because he gets like what 400 CC or is it? How much do you get? You get do you get 200 400 CC per ult level? Because I'm missing quite a few CC just from that. But yeah, my my closet for like Lost Veins getting pretty nasty. I'm getting there, trying to max everything out. Almost close enough, but we're not there yet. Uh, but yeah, that is uh, the team. I, I don't really have to show too much. Uh, yeah, let's just jump in because I don't want the video to be too long. Okay, um, just in case you're watching this in the future, not during this week, um, the actual week, weekly rule for this time is to increase basic stats by 1% per overfilled. field. So the fact we're rushing all means we're going to fill up our basic stats by at least 5%. Um, if we start first, it's not the greatest because we're going to have the, the lowest orb in that turn. Uh, but it, it doesn't really make too much of a difference, but it's there. It's something to be aware of. Now, uh, let's eat our food and jump in. Okay, uh, standard T, let me start first. Rip, 1k, man. Okay, if he tax it, was kind of screwed. Actually, no, we watch our Renault, it's fine. But then he can fossilize us. Ugh. Okay, let's see. Hopefully, we fossilize right now or like Lost Lane or something. Okay, he's going for the tax table. Uh, he can't rush all. No, he can purify though. But then he can't. Okay. Let's see. Okay, thank you. Uh. We have to use this, regardless. Um. I'm pretty sure, right? Because he's gonna... He's gonna have to fossilize. And I, I think our Aaron's dead next turn anyway. So we just, we just uh, Don't crit, please. Nice. Okay, thank you. So now he's got a kill. He's got, he can, he's got a fossilized too. I mean, maybe he doesn't kill, but he's not going to stop my uh, my lost fame from attacking because I have gold cards. Oh, okay, he's tax stable in. Okay. Okay. Um, annoying because now we're pretty much dead. Um, once again, about global. Uh, global does not have that feature where Eren gets full health. Uh, we'll just use the car. I want to get rid of it. 
Minus 35 attack. King can purify, so it doesn't really matter. Maybe we survive, though. Surely King purifies, right? Oh, what the hell was he doing? Why did you not purify it? Oh, he didn't kill, though. Okay, did we kill with our uh, Lost Fane? He didn't crit either, that's annoying. Oh, he did crit, he did crit. Did we just wipe his whole team out with this card? Or these two cards? Surely, right? Bro, show show me the money. Uh, Just in case it doesn't kill, why not? We'll rush out as well. Ah, oh, I should use that first, actually. Oh, yeah, we definitely need it. Oh, mate, bro! <laughs> Oh, hey, to see it. You thought that all was gonna. He should have purified. I don't know what he's doing. He, surely, wait. He didn't use it before, did he? We'll throw off now. Uh, he can win. If he keeps the stack stable in, but we can just rush ult fast. I think. No, he's going for the Merlin. Perfect shield. Oh no, okay, he's good for the removal. Good for us because we can. Just, yeah, we pretty much won. Like we, we yeah, look, we crit as well. We can just kill the Gopher quickly. I super lucky that the aeronaut came in clutch 6-6 six, six. otherwise we would have lost cuz uh it took enough to actually you know stop him from killing us should have purified I think that's one comes down to people don't really know what Aaron does so uh, he yeah he forfeited he must have thought Aaron doesn't lower attack by 35% because that that kept us alive pretty much okay and it's the same person no, it's not. Okay, everyone's just using that team, man. It's so oh, he's not rushing too. Okay, we did get our ult, though. Um, which means he's got to use go for. I mean, depending on what the merger is. Oh no, I think we win. Yeah, no, we're fine. Yeah, we're fine. He can't. He can't stop us. He's got to go for the kill. Um, and then I think we just kill with Aaron probably. Surely, right? These guys are buffed up. Okay, no, we don't. Okay, Lost Fane's dead. Oh, Aaron gets old next turn too. He's got to rush go for ult. Do we keep the cards? He's got attack table. He can't fossilize. Attack table will be his best bet, so we can't kill afterwards. Or he thinks we can't kill. Uh, we can have to kill King as well, because King can heal all back, can it? Okay, let's see. Come on, don't attack table. No, he's going for the kill. Wait, what? Oh, don't use Aaron, please. Oh, why is it we going for Aaron, man? <laughs> uh, it's kind of lucky we didn't get this card here. Uh, okay, we'll just we'll just kill here. Okay, beam onto you. Get the ignite for a little bit extra damage, just in case you don't die. And this will kill. We'll do, we'll do the final kill onto King. Six six Escanor definitely kills. There's no question. Link for Merlin as well. Goodbye. Boom, and a crit too, you know. <laughs> Oi. Alright. Granted, we've not attacked over for two turns. So, quite a lot of damage can happen here. But I think we're fine. Can I go kill Gopher quick? Because you keep attack saving. Oh my god, that did so much damage. Yeah, see, attack team could be a problem here. But I think we can rush over somewhere we're fine. Because he shouldn't really do too much damage. Okay, uh... Okay, we rushed Lost Vayne out. Alright. I mean, he's eventually going to run out of cards to upgrade. I mean, like... He's got to put his shield up. Yeah, he, come on. Surely he just... He's got to, like, what, remove... Oh, and he can't attack table too, so that's good for us. Almost killed, but not enough. Okay, let's go for the Merlin now. Uh, if we move... Nah, we'll just do it for next turn. I think this kills even. And we reset goes passive. Goes to passive, bro. I stacked like three times. Yeah, okay, we win. Alright, bro, I was close, bro. What the hell was I just go for? He was 6 out with 1 ult. I mean, I respect it. A tier 3, obviously, that's like big damage from Merlin. It almost killed as well. Yeah, he's forfeited. Oi! 
Go for almost with the carry there. Jeez. Uh, we'll do one more. Okay, Merlin in the front this time. Uh, that means ult rushing. Probably got three orbs. No, he didn't bring food. Okay. Uh, crap. Okay. Um, he can remove ult. So let's 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 not let's not mess around here. Okay. He. Uh, it's this, we got a bad start. We want we want to get a thing here. We'll, do, we'll use these cards for now. Trying to. Uh, yeah, we'll just try and kill the Merlin quick. Evasion. Are you what what are you doing? <laughs> I mean we would have killed her as well as the annoying thing. I mean I wanna get Aaron card so we can stop, please. Oh bless. Nice. Okay, we can rush ult. But can he kill? I feel like he's just gonna rush ult. Because most people, I'm sure most people in the game don't realize that Aaron can actually disable ultimates for one turn. So we can actually rush ult. And it doesn't matter if he tax disables us too. Okay, go for the tax table. Doesn't matter. And we can rush. No, wait, can we? Can you kill though? He can probably kill. Uh, if I do that. Do we save the card? Nah, we don't. We don't. We definitely get Aaron's. We definitely get Eskimo's ult. We're moving it. We're moving it. Okay, cool. Um, I freaked out there. I freaked out. Because the thing is. I feel like, anyway, he's going to target Escanor, try and take him out with Lost Vein. Which means uh, he's going to forget about Eren. And now, since we can only disable it for one turn, it just means it will have no use, right? If our Eren says life this turn, then we kind of win here. Yeah, he's going for the, he's going for the Lost Vein. Or go for the, uh, the Escanor. Yeah, okay. It's kind of what we wanted. So, uh, not really, but... Okay, that's fine. So, now... We should... Okay, it's Red King too. Okay, that's fine. Reset passive on you. Uh, you know what? Let's just say for two turns. Why not? <laughs> Why not? Uh, we'll do you a swap. Oh, but this is actually the perfect hand, you know. Oi. Because now we're going to get Lost Vayno. And we disabled for two turns. So it doesn't matter if he killed Eren. Eren's already done his job. We might even kill Lost Vayne. Oh, bro. The cards. You shouldn't even rank us up. <laughs> Oi. What now? <laughs> what now? You can't even know. Bro, we didn't even transform Aaron. I didn't transform once. That's the annoying thing about Aaron, man. No, we did transform once. So that's a lie. We, we got uh, the transformation off once. But Aaron, it's hard, man. It really is hard. We're fire. Ah, he's forfeited. Let me transform, man. Aye. Okay, that's annoying. Anyway, that is going to wrap today's video. Like I said, not the best team I know, but it's my highest CC team. I typically, or ideally, I want to use Blue King in front, because as you see, Gopher is used everywhere, right? And a big counter towards this team is definitely the fact that, well, if one attack table kind of ruins the whole plan. If uh, the ideal plan, even though I don't want Escanor in the fourth slot, because he's not beneficial um, until he does come in. But to be fair, a fourth slot Escanor is kind of scary. Uh, so yeah, if we had Blue King here, we could obviously heal up. We could stop attack disabling. Uh, we could transform more often since, well, Petrifying and other stuff like that would kind of stop it. And uh, yeah, Lost Bane's kind of nasty. Um... Not the best investments on my account with the de with the Derriere and Deldre you are gear, but it is what it is. Uh, I'm hoping, if you don't know, uh, Deanne Banner should be coming soon. The big red Deanne, and uh, she is a giant, so he boost up giant attack. I kind of want to go for her, uh, but uh, if, if you haven't watched my last video, go ahead and watch that. I kind of explain it there, but yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching, and uh, peace.